The fire check thermal shutoff valve turns any pneumatically operated process valve into an emergency shutoff valve, and it does so without affecting the normal operation of that valve. The fire check valve is testable and resettable, and offers other significant advantages over fusible links, fusible plugs, and plastic burn-through tubing. Here's how it works. Inside the fire check valve, there is a coil made of a patented shape memory alloy that changes physical state at a certain temperature. When the actuation temperature is reached, the coil triggers the fire check valve's two important emergency shutoff functions. One, it vents the actuator, allowing the process valve to return to its fail-safe position, which is typically closed. Two, it stops the supply air from potentially feeding the fire. The fire check valve installs simply on the supply airline of the process valve's pneumatic actuator, either as a retrofit or a new installation. The complete series of fire check valves includes models to work on actuators of almost any size. For smaller actuators, the fire check valve is used by itself, and it can be installed anywhere on the supply airline to the actuator. When larger actuators require a higher CV exhaust for a faster return to failsafe, the fire check valve is enhanced by the simple addition of a quick exhaust diverter valve. When extremely large actuators require local thermal shutdown capability, the fire check valve is packaged with a high flow pilot valve. These pilot valve models are available with ports from 1 quarter inch to 1 inch and in various mounting styles including Namor, plate mounted, inline NPT threaded, and inline with compression fittings. They are also available with an explosion proof control solenoid, allowing them to provide for actuator control as well as emergency shutdown. For complete details on the fire check series, get pricing, or configure the model that's right for your application, use the links in the upper right corner of this video.